Find anything? Seven wishes. A girl inherits, finds, discovers, is gifted a wish box and doesn't really believe what she has and makes an offhanded wish that suddenly comes true and her life starts to get better. And it is the spiral into those feelings and, and like the feelings of addiction, um, you want more. I wish Darcy Chapman would just go rot. He just said it haunted him and that he couldn't stop thinking about it. And there were, there were elements of the script and story that were very appealing to him. And he had worked with Joey King on The Conjuring and he said, you know, there's this actress, I haven't worked with her in a few years and now she's the right age, you know, have you considered Joey King? And I said, you know, she's been our first choice pretty much for, since we, the project got to Broadgreen. Uh, casting director had mentioned Joey um, and said that she thought she would be sort of magical for the movie and it's sort of interesting how the serendipitous nature of all of that because we had another director at one point who was very interested and she also wanted to work with Joey so it was Joey 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 <laughs> um, so it, it would have been very sad if Joey hadn't done the movie to be honest because everyone was talking about her and she ended up loving the script so it's good wish for anything? Money? Get in! What is happening right now? Love? Did that just happen? There have been others who've had the box. They and everyone they loved all died. Immediately when we were thinking, once we had Joey as Claire, we were kind of thinking, who would her friends be? And we loved the idea of Shannon Purser from Stranger Things. We'd all seen the show, we all liked it, and we thought she might be an interesting idea for June. We were lucky enough to get her. Um, she was really excited about doing the movie. And then with Sydney Park, she wasn't originally, we thought of her for Darcy Chapman, the, the mean girl. And, and that wasn't necessarily quite the right part for her. Then we auditioned her for Lola, one of the other mean kids, popular kids, and then it finally occurred to us for Meredith, and it's insane that we didn't think of her for Meredith immediately because she so embodies the spirit of that character, and she's so talented, and she's so funny and smart, and, and now she's on The Walking Dead, and so that was just like this extra added bonus that we didn't have any idea about when we cast her. I wish. I wish.